Songs of Space Time. Let's go with this. What do you see? Out there in the dark. <laughs> A cloud. For thousands of years, we've looked to the stars to find our place in the universe. Yet the essential forces of life remain invisible to our eyes. Mm -hmm. Gravity is a warp in space-time. Its force pulls clouds of dust together. <laughs> well, a hello, sun. Out of the ashes, a new star is born. Reach out and feel the energy of the star. Energy. <laughs> Look inside the star. Oh no, that's harmful. The atoms in our bodies were forged in the heart of stars. We too are made of stardust. Um. Hmm. Okay. Some stars burn for billions of years. This one won't. The more massive the star, the faster it burns. This star will only live a few million years. <laughs> only for our perspective. Oh yeah, blue giant. I know some kind of science around space and just kind of longevity of things. Dies, it explodes in a violent supernova. Yeah. Don't destroy my headset, please. Okay. Yeah. Oh wow. This supernova rattles the fabric of space, opening a void we call a black hole. Oh yeah, because after supernova there's either a black, black hole or so strong, it this the white it. Uh, thing. This is called gravitational lensing. Just the animations are so cool here. Nothing can escape. Not even light. <laughs> Time itself is warped as it's pulled towards the black hole center. You are a star sucked into the black hole's gravitational pull. Oh shit. One minute oh, black my. hole's gravity. And a thousand years passes on Earth. This is crazy. Uh -oh. <laughs> Getting center, sucked. We peer towards nothingness. Unlike other corners of space, black holes possess an event horizon. A boundary that cuts it off from the rest of the universe. Nobody has ever seen what awaits inside. <laughs> Them. You can't see into a black hole, but you can see out. Once you cross the event horizon, the whole universe is suddenly visible above you. Really? Pass this threshold, and there is no escape. <laughs> Gravity increases as you fall towards the heart of a black hole. Its force stretches a star into strands of light. Below you is the singularity, a one-dimensional point where gravity becomes infinite. Hmm. Interesting. This is the center of a black hole. At the singularity, a star is lost forever 
as it vanishes into nothingness. Nothingness. <laughs> the laws of space and time. Oh my god. Reply. So cool. Oh shit. Reach out and make your way towards the surface. Dude, that's not gonna happen. Never, if we're going into black hole. Unfortunately. You are a black hole. Oh. A tear in the fabric of the universe. Reach towards the glowing star. To suck her in. <laughs> I have to reach like that because the hand tracking is close, kinda. The worst only up close to the headset. Oh. Z like in Star Wars. And it dead. Oh wow. Nothing can escape your grasp. Not even another black hole. Black hole stacking other black holes? Hmm, that's hmm. When two black holes collide, they bang on the surface of time like a drum. Bang on the surface of time? Am I hearing correctly? <laughs> correctly? <laughs> oh shit, the waves. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's trippy. <laughs> Holy hell! <laughs> I'm getting emotions a little bit. <laughs> ah! Oh shit! My head is like spinning. Jesus. Oof, oof. Oof, is this the end? <laughs> I feel like <laughs> no. Okay. Collision of two black holes creates a gravitational wave. Mm -hmm. A ripple in the fabric of space time. Invisible to our eyes, these waves travel billions of years, eventually reaching Earth. For the first time, we hear two black holes sing. <laughs> sing? It's Apura in space? Use the sound of your voice to hear the music of the cosmos. <clears throat> oh! Oh, that's why uh, they... Uh, like... Uh, they had to give you a permission to kind of speak, like recording audio in the application, because you steer with everything, like with your voice here or something. I mean, it's good for me because I record now, so I can speak fully, but... <laughs> yeah. What else can you hear? Me? Out there. Okay, nice. That was very much more intense than the first experience. That's for sure. Jesus Christ. <laughs> but yeah, very like a very much uh, <laughs> way better visuals and just like kind of the space experience. Like you this time you're just like moving around the black holes and stuff like that. So this one was way better than the first one for sure.